Good morning. I thought I'd uh, show you uh, the new combustion chamber for my uh, rocket heater. There's the old used and abused uh, version. The new combustion chamber is made out of a quarter inch 304 stainless steel on the bottom. I kept the carbon steel uh, feed chute just because the heat isn't so bad there. Uh, the heat riser is 316 stainless steel. Uh, I wanted to use 316 on the combustion chamber, but everything would have been special order, and uh, unlike the federal government, I, I don't do deficit spending. Uh, some other changes I've made is this time I went with a bolt-in configuration. If I can come around here, I, I just bolted into the hot water tank instead of welding it in because I seem to have to take this apart too much. Uh, or the feed line going into the combustion chamber. Uh, the lower draft control, I decided to hinge it. Uh, just one less piece for me to lose. I seem to lose things awfully easily. Whether this stands up to the the, the heat, I just don't know. I, I have my doubts. Uh, looking at the, uh, here's the burn pot ash pan, what I call, and there's my oil dispersion plate. But what I wanted to show you, if by chance this this works and holds up, I'll have to rebuild this as well. Um, if you and I've had people ask me, you know, about going with thicker material. And if you Google um, scaling of carbon steel, you'll see that this just cannot stand excessive temperature. It, regardless of how thick you go, it's still going to keep flaking, and eventually, it's just going to disappear. And a good example is right here. You can see the the flaking, and this is just isn't going to hold up. I've tried lining this with furnace cement. I've tried lining it with tile and uh, diminishing returns are setting in real quick with this. So like I say, if this, if this holds up uh, I will rebuild this out of stainless steel but if this gives me any trouble at all any degradation, I'll just rebuild my uh, Ozer waste oil heater and uh, we'll go with that. And I had a friend ask me, I have a wood burning stove in my shop and well, you got plenty of wood, and I got plenty of wood, uh, just burn wood. Well that's true, I, I could, but the, the wood stove for whatever reason it just eats up uh, firewood like there's no tomorrow and I'd probably, for a 16 by 32 foot shop uh, I burn, I can go through a face cord of wood a week and uh, it's, it's just too much. Uh, this has been, my Ozer was cost effective, I don't know how much oil I went through a year, probably, I don't know, 50, 60 gallons uh, of used free uh, motor oil. Time will tell. I'm, I'm hoping that this stands up to the, the rigors, but I just don't know. Anywho, that's the latest and greatest. Take care.